Hi everyone, it's Rick here from The Game Creators. So in this video I'm going to show you how to take the project that we've been creating over the last few videos and turn it into an Android APK file. So currently uh, it's working in Windows. Let's quit the game and go to File and choose Export Project to Android. Okay, and up pops this big complex screen. Don't worry too much about it. It's quite straightforward. So this APK I'm going to save. It's going to create it onto the hard drive on the PC. And then I'm going to copy it onto my Google Drive. And then from my phone I'm going to install it via Google Drive app. So the settings that we need to know about here the APK type we've got it set to Google. You could do Amazon or you could do Ouya. We want a, a Google formatted APK. We've given the app a name called Silly Seesaw, a package name. This is really more for when you come to publish, but there's my name and dot the name of the project. Uh, an app icon, although you only need a 192 by 192 image. Uh, the one I'm choosing is uh, 1024 by 1024. I just made it up. And you'll see that when we've made the app. Uh, we don't have any notifications, so we don't need an icon. It's going to be a portrait game. Obviously you could choose landscape or both if your app was able to do both orientations. We're going to target the lowest API, which is API 15, so it means it will work on as many devices as possible. We're not using AR Core. We've got a few permissions already set. They're the default ones. We don't need any of the others. And we're going to output into this folder the APK. Now we don't need any of these additional settings. So we just click Export. We already saved it before, so we'll just say yes, overwrite. It takes a few seconds. And it's done. We can see we've got an APK built today. And if I get my Google Drive screen up, I can copy it over there. And it's uploading now to Google Drive. Just a really handy way to quickly get the APK onto the device. Now, if you've got a device you want to run it on, you need to turn on developer options. Do a search on the internet to find out how to enter developer options on your phone because they're all different. OK, it's done now. Let's see it on the phone. So here we are. We're running the APK. We're doing a package installation on the device. It's now installing. You can see the icon. And before we know it, our app is on the phone and we can open it and run it. It's that simple. I've used a little bit of software called MobiZen to record my phone. It's a useful app, so check that out if you're interested. I'll put the link in the description below. Well, that's how you make an APK in App Game Kids Studio. See you next time.